We've got uh, decent temperatures out there. It's not that muggy. And the rain, at least for the most part, is staying at bay. I look across the board here, mid-70s. And usually we start climbing up mid-70s, low-80s before we start to feel a little bit of mugginess. But that moisture, not really that present. We've got upper 50s to low 60s. So the muggy factor, not, not hugely in effect for us. Might be a little sticky out there. Uh, not too bad at all. Still seeing those scattered showers and even a few thunderstorms. Carroll down through Omaha, up near Waterloo as well. And these will continue to taper off into the evening for us. You can see not a whole lot else out there besides that scattered mess. And off to the east in Chicago, they're seeing a little bit more formidable of a system push through. But we're just on the backside of that now, which is why we're seeing those north winds. Uh, you can see a lot of water to go around out there. Raccoon River overflowing. 76 is what we're at right now. A nice breeze out there out of the northeast at 9 miles per hour. And we are going to continue the niceness as we head into the evening and tomorrow. We drop down to 62 by 7 o'clock in the morning. Those clouds and the rain clear out. And that's going to leave us with sunshine. 82 degrees by 4 p.m. Not quite to our average of 84, but still pretty nice out there. Dew points dropping into the upper 50s. So we're not talking tropical. We're not even talking muggy. We're back down to uh, pleasant conditions. And those will be with us for a couple days here. Uh, we do eventually bring in a little bit of rain into our Sunday. So we take a look at high pressure diving down. That's going to help to bring in that sunshine for us tomorrow. Our next system will be making its way on this high pressure's heels into Sunday. And that's going to bring chances for showers and even thunderstorms, mainly through eastern portions of the state. Until then, though, we're looking pretty darn good. Future, Futurecast has us in the spotty stuff for a little bit longer here. And you can see it clears it up pretty rapidly as we head into the overnight tonight. And after that, only bringing in some weak cloud cover throughout the day on Saturday. So if you are headed out for any of the festivities this weekend, it's looking pretty darn good, especially for Saturday. Again, Sunday, we do bring in those chances for a little bit of rain. Enjoy your evening tonight. Those showers and thunderstorms will be tapering off. Light breeze out of the north, 61 is our, is our overnight low. Back up to 82 tomorrow. Sunny, gorgeous day. Get out and enjoy it. We've got the sunshine no matter wh where you're at. Likely pick up a little bit of cloud cover throughout the day, but I do think that we will be staying dry for our Saturday. And the next few days, not quite as lucky. We climb it back to 82 Sunday. Early on, that's your best chance for showers and thunderstorms. Monday, another day to dry out. But as we head into the middle of next week, we bring in more chances for scattered showers and thunderstorms and backing down that temperature to 75 by next Saturday. Thank you, Jason. Lots going on in traffic. Let's get right to